That means to get to what Kevin McCarthy says is their budget goal, we have to slash 70% of the rest of federal spending, nutrition programs, ag programs, uh, help for the aged, help for students, uh, non-Medicare health care programs, like we just cut the heart out of Medicaid. It's not doable, OK? And it'd be catastrophic economically. But here's the point I want to make. A lot of the folks who are advocating on the Republican side for that budget, it's not just about getting rid of the deficit. It's about disempowering government to help people. They don't want to do it. They don't want Medicaid. They don't want it. They don't want to have a debate about having infrastructure spending go to local schools. You know, it's a kind of you're on your own approach. That's what's so radical about it. It's not just that it's not doable and they're not on the level about what they're saying. There's a real cadre in the House, especially, that basically is very much against the use of government regulatory authority to protect the health and safety of citizens, tax po taxing power to meet the needs of hardworking citizens. And that includes higher education, by the way. So that's the heart of this struggle uh, that is really beyond and beneath the numbers.